Hello my lovelies and welcome back to JD's Nails. As today is a Tuesday, I'll be doing a weekly collab video. So I joined the ladies of YouTubers Nail Art Stamping Weekly Collabs. And this week's host, Alicia Carlos from Ali's blog proposed the theme insects for this week. So seeing that I have an insect phobia and just insects on a whole make me want to itch, I chose, yes, butterflies. I know it's, you know, it's the go-to thing for insects, but I just, I can't deal with other types of insects. So let's get started. So I'm going to start with a base. And this is my dual chrome nails. So I used chrome powder over polish. And it's really easy, guys. All you need is, well, you use whatever polish you want to use, right? Then you use a gel effects top coat. So this is my gel polish top coat from Essence. So you allow that to dry until it's kind of sort of tacky. So in the meantime, I'm putting on some peel off protection because the powder goes everywhere in all types of creases. So it's just easier for cleanup. And while that's drying, your polish will dry, but don't let it dry too much because you still need that tacky layer. I'm showing you this superb powder it's one of those powders i got from wish you just need to dab it onto the, the nail rub it and then rub the excess off with a brush and you can top coat with the same essence top coat but some people use water-based top coats so moving on i'm going to now stamp my butterfly and this is a very big butterfly so what i decided to do was uh Stamp the body of the butterfly on my middle finger and then stamp the wings on the nearby fingers so it could look like the butterfly is extending on all three fingers. I don't know, I had this idea in my head and I like how it came out. So let me know what you think down below. And then to complement the main butterfly effect on my three middle fingers, I decided to stamp smaller butterflies on my pinky and my thumb. All the plates will be listed down below, so don't worry if I, you know, I didn't mention the exact number. I moved the excess surrounding images for the pinky and then I stamped the full image on my thumb. And now I'm going to use this beautiful uh, polish from Hema. It's a French store and it has tons of polishes. And this is the dupe for the scattered hollow glitter from China Glaze, I think. Yeah. So this is the final look. It's really pretty. I love how it came out. It's all chromey and sparkly, hollow. I just, it came out wonderfully. I love it. Thanks for watching and let me know what you think of this manicure. Would you try this if you have the same plate? If you do, please tag me on my Instagram and see you guys later.